Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a massive haul for you guys. I got some stuff from Princess Polly, Dolls Kill, Zara, a couple of pieces from a shop that I found on Instagram as well. If you guys already follow me on Instagram, you guys have probably already seen the Princess Polly haul that I posted on my Instagram story. I'll put like timestamps down below if you've already seen the haul and you want to skip past the Princess Polly stuff. But I'm going to start off with Princess Polly first. So the first piece is going to be this brown knit bralette top. This is really cute for the summertime. There's no glass on like the back side or anything but it is pretty stretchy this one I got in a size extra small. Next piece that I picked out is this long wide leg brown linen pant. Very lightweight for the summer. Paired it with the brown bralette top that I first showed you guys. And I got these pants in a size US 2. In bottoms, I'm usually like an extra small small. A size 2 fits perfectly. Next piece is this darker brown ribbed crop top. Kind of hard to tell what it looks like but you'll see it in the try on. It has these really long straps so you can style it different ways. So the first way that I style this, I kind of just wrapped it around my body like the model did on the website. And then another way that I like to wear this, I actually like to wear it with the back side as the front. You can do different things. I strapped it around my body at one time and then around my arm. Thought it looked really cute that way. But I really, really like this top. It's very versatile and you can get a lot of wear out of it because you can style it so many different ways. This top I got in a US size 4. Next piece that I picked out is this brown knit mini skirt with a little slit at the bottom. This one is kind of more of a thicker knit material. It hugs around my body very well. Yeah, really feeling the brown tones for the summer, so definitely a piece that I wanted to add to my closet. I got this one in a size extra small. This next piece is probably my favorite one from Princess Polly. It's this knit ombre blue halter dress. It's very lightweight for summer. It's very breathable. It's like not gonna get you too hot. I also styled it as a skirt too. I've seen a lot of people on Instagram wearing their halter dresses undone and just kind of as a skirt. So like the strap parts hanging down. I got this dress in a size extra small to small and this one does come in other colors as well. I also found the mini skirt version of that dress too. Made out of the same knit material. Very breathable. But yeah, if you guys aren't into the whole halter dress as a skirt trend, they do have that dress in a mini skirt version. Got in a size extra small small. Next are these really cute black strappy heels, like a Nuba kind of material. I got this in a size 7, which is what I usually am, and they do fit true to size. I also picked out some really cute accessories to go with the outfits that I picked out from Princess Polly. The first one being these brown sunnies from there. Just thought it'd be really cute to pair with the brown outfits that I picked out. I picked out some really cute multicolored glass rings. I have like a yellow one and then a clear one, light blue, lavender, and light pink color. Really cute, like stacked or you can even just wear it like on its own and then I picked out this really cute random beaded necklace you guys have probably seen these kind of necklaces all over Instagram these are really trending right now along with those like little phone charms too really really like the bead variation on this specific one and then last piece from Princess Polly is just this dark navy blue hair cloth I just thought it would be really cute to pair with the blue outfits that I picked up I do have a code for you guys for Princess Polly I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the description and I'm gonna move on to Dolls Kill I only ordered one thing from there but it's the one that I'm the most excited about. It's a pair of calf high boots by Darker Waves. I think that's how you pronounce it. So this style is called the snare leather squared toe platform boot. Here are the boots. So freaking cute. Here's the front side of them. And then the back side right here, it says Darker Wave. But oh my gosh, I... I was dying when I got these. I was so close to caving in and buying the Naked Wolf Impact Black Boot because I really wanted like a calf high or like knee high boot. Couldn't put myself to spending 350 on a pair of boots that I could probably find from the thrift store. I did find like a really cute pair from the thrift store but they weren't like as good quality. I did only get them for like $10 as well. So they retail for $138 and then after taxes and shipping it came out to $159 USD. It's definitely worth it for these. The leather feels like very good quality and the fit is perfect. So my thing about boots like these is my calves aren't really big. I'm pretty petite. So whenever I would try on boots like this, the opening wouldn't really hug around my leg well and it'd be like excess space, which I didn't like. These ones 
fit like a glove. I know I'm gonna get so much wear out of these. But yeah, very satisfied with these boots and I'm so glad that I didn't cave in and buy the Naked Wolf ones. Oh, also I ordered these in a size seven women's, which is my usual size and they fit pretty true to size. Okay, so I'm gonna move on to Zara. So I went in store to check out some of the stuff that they had and then I also ordered some stuff online. They're having their big sale right now too. So all the pieces that I picked out are on sale. So the first item is the 90s full length denim pants in Arctic gray. I have this pant in black in a blue denim already and I really like the fit of these. These ones are really cute, very high-waisted and they were on sale for $22.99. Next piece is this striped knit maxi dress. really like the colors and I thought it'd be really cute for summer. The material of this knit is kind of thick though. I feel like I might get hot in this during the summer, but I don't know. We'll see. I have to try this one on. This one was originally $35.90 and I got it on sale for $22.99. I also picked out a knit set a lot of knits this summer and then i also bought the matching knit short they were sold out in a size small in this cardigan so i just went and grabbed it in a size medium the original price of this cardigan was 39.90 and i got it for 25.99 and then for the shorts i got it in a size small original price 35.90 got it on sale for 22.99 next up i got this really cute tank crop top just a basic piece. It almost looks like it's a terry cloth material. I really like the color tone of this. I wear a lot of neutral tone stuff, so I know I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this one. I got in a size extra small to small. The original price was $17.90 on sale for $12.99. Next up is this really cute khaki olive green short shorts. It's kind of in this waffle thermal material. Very thick. I feel like it's gonna hug on my butt very well. This would be cute to like lounge around in at the house or I kind of pictured wearing this with an oversized blazer. It comes with a matching top, but I didn't really like how the top looked. It's more of like a loose fit long sleeve top. But if they had like a matching bralette or something with this, I would have bought it. I got these shorts in a size small and I got it on sale for $12.99. I picked out some more crop bralette tops. I don't have like a neon orange one, so I thought this would be a really cute pop of color. And I got in a size extra small to small and I got it on sale for $9.99. We got another bralette top. This one is more of like a sporty look, ribbed material. It's very lightweight and very stretchy. White right here and then it's lined with navy blue. It's extra small to small. Got it on sale for $9.99. Last two pieces from Zara. They're just some basic ribbed crop tops. I already own this in the cream colored one. I really like the fit of it. Got it in this plum purple colored one and I also got it in a black one. Can't go wrong with black. Got both of these crop tops in an extra small to small. Original price $17.90 and I got it on sale for $12.99. So next I stopped by a Brandy Melville and I picked up some biker shorts. I already own the gray ones and I really like the fit of them so I just got it in this light stone wash color and then I also got it in this dark gray. It's only one size for most of the things at Brandy Melville so I can't really give you a size that I picked out. It's just one size and I got both of them for 16 USD. The last pieces for this haul I purchased from a small designer that I found on Instagram. Actually, I first stumbled upon her stuff on Depop. I ordered a couple pieces from her before off of her Depop. These two pieces are actually from her site that she just opened up. The first piece that I picked out is this really cute crop top. It has like the strings laced through the front of the shirt right here and the back side as well. I mean, you can wear it either way. There's not really like a tag on the inside that shows which side is the front. I really like the material of this one too. It's very like sporty. And then I also picked a crop top that's kind of the same style as the last one, just in a different print or fabric. This one is more of like a knit. I really like the print of this one too. I really like all the stuff that she always comes out with. I'm gonna go ahead and link her accounts and her site down below so you guys can go and check her out. And that's it for the haul you guys. Thank you if you made it to the end. I am gonna be filming a thrift haul. I'm gonna throw in some Depop and Etsy stuff in there as well so look out for that. But yeah, thanks again for watching you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!